Okay, three step Excel. So what we're looking for here is how well can you push and project? So that means are your foot strikes effectively moving your center of mass forward and accelerating your body? So we, we're looking at Morgan here, all conference midfielder, very fast open field runner, but we're looking at her start, which in her sport is vital to be effective at. The goal here is to get three to four powerful pushbacks. So let's look at our first rep here. Not bad. In full speed, it looks okay, but we filmed it, slowed it down, and we watched it together. And you can see that her first step doesn't quite finish the push. Also her torso angle is a little bit upright. So she ran a couple more, uh, but with this next clip, her goal now was to think power instead of speed. So we said, hey, let's try to be more powerful, finish your pushes, and think about not going so fast with your feet, but getting the most out of every step. And that was a cue that she needed because while she might have spent longer on the ground with each step, she was able to finish each pushback and uh, propel herself forward better. Look at how powerful and fully she extends on this one. Bang. And now she's in position with that left foot to come striking down, which she does, and she repeats it by striking and pushing away again. Great angle, great finish of the push. So going back to her first rep, you notice that she doesn't really get into full extension with these steps. She noticed that she kind of leaves that back knee slightly bent before she takes it off the ground. And in turn, she kind of has to be a little upright. So everything has a reaction, right? In comparison, you look at this next rep here. She still puts the foot down in front of her a little bit, but she does a great job of finishing and powerfully pushing herself forward in the second rep. Look at that. So that's full extension all the way to the toe off, maintains that torso angle. In fact, it's actually a better angle now. She's in perfect position to strike, which she does with that left foot. Another powerful push. And just notice that her hips are moving very well. They're traveling forward, not much bouncing. And they're covering ground. That's what we call projecting. So within three to four steps, she made up about a half a yard, which in any sport is huge, right? That's what we call getting a step on your opponent. So just with that one little adjustment, just with her understanding that I don't need to move my feet fast, I need to be more efficient and more powerful with each step, she was able to make about a half a yard of difference. So great adjustment there. That's credit to her as well, being a smart athlete. So that's just one example of how we can give them um, cues that help them to understand the goal better. And so they can make the ad adjustment internally and then understand exactly what effect that's having by seeing it um, after it's done.